I'm Marilyn Karsten, and I have been here at Lutheran Church of the Master, not this facility, but I started in 1970. So I've been here for 52 years. This has been my home church. This is where we raised our boys. We had two boys when we joined the church, and the third one, which is Derek, came four years later. And my first two were baptized in the Wheat Ridge area, and Derek was baptized at the old church. And Don was raised a Catholic, so of course, his whole life of church was far, far different than what we had. And we worked on the, this church when it was being built. And Don was involved, although he always worked so many hours. He worked for the phone company, and he worked probably 60 hours a week. So I've always been the one that has kind of helped raise the children. But I've had the support. I've had the support of this whole congregation through many things. So that's been really important to me. I've been discouraged at times uh, in things that have happened and I've always said I won't leave because this is my church and I'm part. And I don't want to cry but I can't help it sometimes. You know I've always had so much support from everybody and I've been very lucky because it's just been, you know, it's it's just been home to me. And I've, I've just needed to have this church. And I've needed to have the people who've supported me and supported Don and supported Oak. I forgot I was going to have this talk about it, but it has been just wonderful because now I'm seeing friends die, and that's even harder. And Several people in this church have reached out to me when things were low. And I don't know I don't know where else to reach for because I don't need it. I've got everybody else. And I like to visit people. I lots of times pick up the phone because I think they need that. We've made over two thousand quilts, baby quilts mostly, but sometimes when I was sewing I get carried away and so I'd end up with a big quilt and I had somebody say to me this morning, Marilyn, I have a big quilt, maybe you can cut it into babies. And I said, no. I take all of that down to Denver Medical, and they can use those for the people who have cancer, they need blankets. So anything I take down there, size-wise, it doesn't make any difference because it's all used. And they're very, very happy to get things. And we get nice thank you letters from them. And Denver Medical has so appreciated what we have done. And, you know, they have 5,000 babies, and so they really need, need, need. I had a sewing class this summer because I said, I want you girls to know how to do this. And so I've given some lessons. Well, now what do we owe you? I don't want money. I've been given a lot of gifts. I really have. And I feel that's why I like to give. You know, this is kind of who I've been, and, and it's been wonderful that I've had the life I've had. And I praise God.